to get to our admin or our institution now that it's actually coming into our um, provinces and it gives us some new policies national tax modifier national unrest hmm artillery combat ability is really good too at this point in the game um, what do we have right now yearly corruption I think the tax modifier would be a lot more money. How much are we spending on rooting out corruption? 50? Yeah. How much are we getting in taxes? 103. Um, so I think it'd be better if we got rid of that and took Hmm, I'll take the money. Militarily, we're ahead of time and we don't have any mill ideas to work on. So I think we'll take that for now. We don't care about those. I think that's better. 103. I guess we'll find out when it ticks. Let's see. Austria, you guys want out? You do. I think we're just going to be a white piece so that's the shortest possible. Um, the other option is we just eat the ridiculous overextension since there's already a giant coalition against us anyway. Um, but that's going to make it a really long it's a 14 year piece when we could just come back in six years yeah we can just come back in 41 whatever we don't need the money we just come back in six years and take that without it costing a ridiculous amount and having us our overextension really screwed over so, yeah, we'll let Austria out. Uh, next, we can get Bohemia out. Um, who else are we at war with? Magburg and Saxony. Saxony is there. Magburg. I don't even know how you spell that. That's not what we were looking for. This is what we want. Oh, they're all the way up there. What fort level? Oh, fort level one? So that would actually be really easy. Oh, we might send these armies up there next. Uh, we don't need that much. We don't need that high of a war score though. Um, we're just taking two provinces off of the Commonwealth. Bulgaria and Milan. Maybe one of these days they won't be hating us. One of these days. Although if we keep getting truces, I guess we should just piece out Saxony too. Um, that way they just have truces with us and they can't do nasty coalition things. Right? That makes sense, I think. It makes sense in my brain. I don't know if it actually makes sense. I think it does. Brandenburg on Denmark. Wow, Denmark is getting just screwed. Super screwed. What are these? Fort level 2, Fort level 6. Um, Nuremberg left, Bavaria left. That's nice. I don't know. Do we take a bunch of their land? I don't think so. I 
think I'd rather be able to fight Spain. That's two years on Spain or France. And I think I would like to declare on Spain. Wow. <laughs> They're freaking allied with Austria too. Oh man. That's hilarious. Freaking just everybody's allied with Austria, man. Yeah, I think I want to just declare on Spain. Um, I don't know what we would take from them. Probably just a bunch of the reconquest stuff. Uh, first, let's get Bohemia out of here. entered an alliance with Saxony. I guess France knew what was coming for them. Or some such thing. Are we down, guys? 25,000 manpower. No, we're not paying 2,000 ducats when we're about to try to embrace an institution. It's definitely not happening. Can we, oh, we're just never going to be able to core this until we take some more stuff from France. But it's in France. It's only giving us 7.5% overextension. It's really not that bad. I don't want to give it to Milan and then... Oh, well, if we're going to have to annex Milan anyway... I guess we might as well... Oh yeah, we can't because we're still at war. That is a thing, right? That is in fact a thing. We just want these two provinces. Just want those two. Morocco entered the coalition. Oh no, what are we gonna do? Um, fabricate on this. Bring this guy home. Can, that means we can set one more guy to outrage for now. It's fort level six, fort level two. I don't want to siege that fort down if we can help it. Uh, so we might siege that one next. Make sure we just loot stuff. 12%, they're still minus 20. It's pretty awkward. Mill advisor died. Who can we get? Don't think. Oh, well, suppose we can afford a plus three. National manpower modifier, I think, is what we're going to take. Yeah. Minus 20, goodness. Um, can we just push their capital real quick? How's that gonna look? Yeah, more money. We don't need the prestige, we're at 100 prestige. Why would I take that? Silly. Um, so let's see, this. We're gonna need one army standing there and one army standing there for something like that. Wow. Alright, well these guys are going back to rebel duty even though they have our best general. 
Um, Saxony may want out. Probably gonna want out soon. Oh, that's not even their capital. If that was their capital, they would. Uh, we'll take Magdeburg out first, I guess. Oh boy. Yeah, this is why um, you pay attention. That could be a stack wipe on us, which is super bad. Oh, we're gonna get... Yep. Brutal. Oh, why weren't we paying attention? 19,000, 31,000 manpower. Just ripped. Just instantly dead. Just shredded. That's really not what we want right now. Not to mention the war score hit that it that it gave us. Yeah. It's our own fault for not paying attention. Can't blame anybody but ourselves there. It's not like the Commonwealth is a complete pushover by any means. Well, I suppose we should re-recruit an army then. Um, just go right there. I think that's at least what we had. Potentially m slightly larger than what we had. Seventeen minus eight. I'm worried they're gonna come push over here, and we don't have a general over there anymore. Hmm. Yeah. Let's move our armies that way to make sure that they don't push us. Maybe that's... Oh, there it is. We have got to get the heck out of here, man. Uh, these guys are going to need to try to get out of there, too. Oh, but they're so close to getting Madgeberg out. It's already 11 o'clock. Holy crap. How close are they? Minus six. We can't disband these guys either. I think we give up the siege. We can come back to it at some point. Uh, what's the best way to get out of here? actually don't know. At least we can give him a leader in forced march now. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sleep yet. I have like another uh, 30 minutes to an hour. I'm still focused. I just want to go to bed at a reasonable time. I'm just trying to figure out how to get this army out of here. Getting stack wiped a second ago was really really bad uh, in terms of keeping up these back-to-back -back wars that I feel like we have to do to actually get all the land we need to form Rome before the game ends um, we actually had a decent bank of almost 40k or something like that maybe I can just go hide and uh, we can kill that stack on the way Um, kill them.
can't move through there. Actually, if we can just stall for time, if we can just stall until these armies can get their woods. We'll chill there. Yeah, if we could stall, we could actually fight that. These guys are gonna do loot something, I guess. All right. Luckily, they're just standing there, sieging that back. It's actually some potential that we could um just piece them out. Oh, they're moving this way. See if we can move this army around that way, maybe. How's it going, dog? I like your name, actually. Dog -a -g 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 All right. Well, somehow we might have made it out of this mess. Yeah, that was that was the rebels dying, thankfully. 71%. 71% siege. All right, well, we'll just we'll just chill here. That way if this stack gets attacked, we can handle it. Let's get this one back. Uh, we might be able to pop a general and wipe them. That's just 11 infantry regiments. Let's give them this guy. We don't need him all the way down there. Just taking back a rebel province. Pretty useless. Pretty epic. That's good. Um, no, things are good. Just... Oh, whoa, whoa. All right, we got a force march to everybody in there. Well, except for those guys, I guess. No! Oh, look away. Look away, get stack wiped. Man. Gross. Did they end their war? Is that why? Yeah. That's nasty. There they are. Just hitting and running. That's a really good general too. That's a really insanely balanced army. <sighs> they are they considered that they're making, yeah, Commonwealth is making gains. Huge rips. This is why I hate like fighting wars on tons of fronts in this game. It actually gets really, really difficult to micro. Uh, you just have to pay so much attention. Especially in areas like this where like they can just, it's so dangerous in here. They can just pop out of the fog out of nowhere and you're like well I guess my army's dead now uh, let's see if we can get these guys back if we can pop that Saxon army I mean, we'll get the manpower back I just need to keep an eye on like where the heck is that Polish army there they are this freaking guy what's his name Arima Zekalno. Oh, that's their army's name. Luidvikas Grabowski. That's a nice Polish name right there. Alright, we might, uh, oh yeah, there they come. 
They're gonna get the crossing penalty and we're in the woods. They're arriving on the 26th, they're arriving on the 16th. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, this army got caught though. That's our best general there. Is he really gonna get stack wiped? There's no way, right? He might, he legitimately might. 25th. Okay, apparently somebody got there to help us. This is even with them having the terrain modifier. Goodness, dude, that cavalry is gross. Absolutely gross. We're gonna have to play this very, very carefully. We might siege this fort with an entire 95k stack. Who's taking more casualties here? I think we are. So I think we retreat. Where's our return province? Can we not pick any of these provinces because... Is there some fort in the way or something? There shouldn't be, we have all these forts. That's, we're allowed to retreat, right? There we go. Um, that Genoese army might be dead. Now they got out of there too. Uh, can we give these guys our best general real quick? Wait, where is he? He was with that army. They don't need him. They're retreating. Should be a win for us. Election, yeah, we'll keep our guy one more time. Now he's gonna be nice, five, six, four. All right, well, there's a stack wipe in our favor. Saxony will leave now. There's that frickin' army. Um, just get reps and a little tiny bit of money. All right, they'll get a crossing penalty, plus we'll be the defender, right? 28, 31st. I doubt they're gonna go for that fight. We're also gonna give uh, this army our best general. And I think this guy's our second best. Um, if we forced March, can we catch him there? Now we want to wait until, oh, there we go. That should be a stack wipe on them. If these guys don't, this is going to be a close fight though, I think. We have 34 artillery in this now. Plus they have a crossing penalty for maneuver now. They're not going to get the crossing, but we'll get the terrain. That's going to be one heck of a battle, but I believe we should win, I think. 109% unity. We'll just go back to some of our cheaper conversions. Oh, so this should be a win there as well. That's a relatively scary stack. Um, we could definitely use these guys up here. All right, we're slaughtering him now. Yeah, get some. See ya on that army. I assume this guy's trying to catch our little tiny army. Yeah, that's what I thought. Well, they have the winged Tassars and we have the Egyptian cannons or something. I don't know what we have, but they got slaughtered there. That was, that was some nice revenge. Let's see if we can piece Madgeburg out real quick while maintaining some semblance of control of this area. Um, just gonna pull these guys back. Brandenburg left the coalition against us. Cool, 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 cool. Like that. It also sucks fighting these back-to-back -back wars without any drill modifier uh is genoa gonna win that fight i don't think you're gonna win that fight you know maybe no two heavies versus one i doubt it 
see if we can catch this this stack uh, do you want out already just because I'm standing on your capital oh they're trying to leave can we force to march and catch them yeah 29 cannons let's get there we have the cannon damage age goal thing so our cannon slaughter some dudes uh we're gonna wait for our institution yeah yeah Woo! see ya now we're the one wiping stacks get out of here poland get out of here yeah, I mean, we definitely have it. It just sucks that it cost us like 60,000 manpower more than I had to. Let's see if we can catch this army next. Uh, I guess we'll occupy that. We're only at 227 force limit. Um, France? No, we're about to declare war on you, so... Uh, I suppose this is the point of the game where I just start hiring mercenaries, though, like out the wazoo. We have admin ideas completed. Dang, that army is holding on for forever. Oh boy, can we peace out? Can we just peace out now? I don't want this to happen. No, that's that nasty army. 34 cav. I, actually, we're in the woods, and they're going to get a cross. No, that's just the woods penalty. I still just don't want that fight to happen. Um, yeah. Oh, no, no, I'm Iron Man. <laughs> Can't save scum. It's fine. We're just gonna peace. We're just gonna sign the peace deal right here, and then this fight won't happen. Yeah, I'm fine with that. If I had um, if I had two diplomats free, I would piece these guys out first. I assumed they would take a peace deal. No, they wouldn't even. So that's fine. Can't even be tempted or regret that I don't have two diplomats. These are the only two provinces that we need. Uh, what else could we take? I don't think we want to take anything else. We need our admin. Seven hundred and eighty. I swear it was like nine hundred a second ago. Maybe it wasn't. Here we go. We avoided that fight. All right, are these still at war with the Ming? Yes. So I think we're just gonna go ahead and declare on Spain here in a second. Um, let's get all of our armies into this area. I uh, might have to transport one or two of them. <laughs> These guys are moving, right? Yeah. Alright, well the coalition's slowly dying. So that's good. Maybe we can actually declare... They're guaranteed by France. Allied with the Commonwealth and Russia? Dude, this game doesn't want me to form Rome. Spain is a freaking PU. Well, Russia has the PU over Spain. These guys are guaranteed by France and allied with Russia and the Commonwealth? Get out of here, dude. Yeah. That's, that's one word for it. <laughs> uh, when can we take our institution? Still not for forever. What's up, hun? Right. I'm just saying what's up. Yeah? Very comfy. Our inflation's starting to run wild. We do have our inflation reduction econ idea though, right? Yeah. Make sure Spain, they're only at 26. I mean, I hope Russia just... Oh, can you see the cat? Oh, sometimes the cats jump up on the back of the um, couch and people can see them. Usually they're quite popular with people watching the stream. 
So Austria once again. Perhaps we can. I think we'll f we'll force them to truce break Russia and the Commonwealth, and then actually fight Spain. Yeah. Um. So we can start the war over here with that army, and this army is just taking forever to get up there. Oh, you want to put the kitty in front of the camera? Ow. Look. <laughs> kitty. Did I get her in there? Say hi to the stream, Lila. I think so, yeah. At least the side of her. Can you turn the light on behind me and turn on the one next to me off, please? That would be... Probably help. Hopefully you guys can see the cat. Yeah, I think that's better. I can actually be seen now. Uh, that's a better leader, I think. How long do we have in our golden era? Still a while, I'm pretty sure. Oh, you know what? It's actually going to suck starting the war on this side because... No, it won't. We can just take this fort. We can ignore that one. We can just take this one and then march through. Although, there's that fort there. Maybe we bring the navy up and we transport people to this side, I think. That'll only take a minute. That'll save us a lot of time. Well, I have to play very manpower efficiently in this next war. Not get stack wiped like that. Uh, this time we can just come up there, I guess. This is just going to annoy me that that's sitting there. I want to keep an eye on my institution too. It should be soon. Yeah, we're not taking that yet. Really would rather um, avoid fighting Russia and Spain. That would be much preferred. I'd really rather not. Um, how's our artillery looking? Could use a little bit more. We're at plus 27. Oh, we couldn't support very much artillery. Mm. We could eat professionalism. But I like the fire damage and the siege ability, especially when we're sieging down frickin' star forts and fortresses that Austria loves to build, apparently. Well, whatever. We just have to go for it. Um, we want to reconquest something in here. Lucca's fine. Albanga's fine. It's actually a Milanese war goal. They both have claims on Lucca. I'd rather give it to Genoa. That way we get it. Uh, let's see. What all does Genoa have? We can take these four plus like that to connect us. And then we could declare another war with Milan over here. Take that stuff from Milan and annex them. All right, so, well, we have our plan. Let's give guys generals. Where's our nice general? This guy is also our siege specialist, so he'll Run up to Wien. Nope, we're declaring on Spain. This is going to be brutal. We're going to be quite outnumbered in this war. So it's probably going to have to try to be short and sweet. Where was that Spanish army that was running around over here? Are they gone? There's a bunch more of them down there. We need to wait so that Genoa just doesn't get wrecked. Good luck winning. Uh, I think we can win. It's going to be 
I mean, Russia is only 2k. Like, if it came down to it, we'd be able to beat Russia and Spain at the same time. It's not going to be easy. Well, yeah, winning fast is going to be the hard part. But if we're taking reconquests on three of like the four provinces or four of the five provinces that we're actually going to take, I mean, we don't need that much war score to do that. Um, then we're just going to have to try to fight. Actually, it's our 43. Yeah, we need to win before our truce with France expires, so we need to declare on them right away. Portugal or Genoa still never fabricated here. So that's kind of awkward. I'm hoping that Spain, like, these guys are going to get caught down here. They can siege that stuff quickly, though. Um, I'm hoping Russia just kind of gets stuck in here. And we don't actually really have to fight much. Find out. Yeah, they're in... Their colonies won't really do much. Let's just say luck as the war goal. Uh, we get our siege specialist on Wien. And we're gonna hire. Actually, where are our mercenaries? It's one mercenary army. Let's play find the mercenaries. What the heck? Oh, you know what? They got stack wiped, didn't they? Our mercenaries did. 11 heavy ships well we better not lose Dalmatia probably would have been better to move these guys um, so let's hire a couple Merc infantry and we're gonna play this one on three as well for sure Wow. Austria has that many guys. They actually have 85,000 guys. It's pretty surprising, honestly. Um, for this one, we're going to want our subjects to play defensive. Don't want them running off and... Well, yeah, I don't think we want them running off. And dying horrible, brutal deaths. We might need to send an army down here to deal with this. With Spain, they're 26. I guess we can just let Genoa mess with them. Uh, we can stand there, we can stand there. That should be enough protection for that siege. I believe. That barely over 41. Why are we? Okay, we're no longer suffering attrition there. Would really prefer not to siege this down, but if we have to, we have to. Can, can Genoa beat Spain? If they played it really well, they'd be able to. I just doubt that they're going to play it super well. I suppose it mostly depends... I mean, like, right now, Spain's armies are split. Like, optimally, you'd go cut that one off, but it is the AI. I'm just hoping that Austria will want to leave once they lose their capital. But I doubt it. 108%. That's a cheap province to convert. Oh, goodbye, Milan. Uh, that's a Spanish stack. Is, are they still going to be? They're still going to be exiled because that's allied land, right? Yeah. Oh, minus 28. Alright, well apparently we're sieging this next. We're gonna need a lot more artillery in there though. I wanna move these armies up. And Genoa's just gonna be getting crushed down here. Poor Genoa. Poor Genoa. And we'll take Ostmark 
first election. Our guy died. Rest in peace. Um, we don't want a military candidate. I think we want a bureaucrat. Nice, loose lips. Solid. And all these are really low unity provinces now. Forty two enthusiasm. Um, I suppose we s oh, we can't siege that down until this is gone. We're going to need. 25 artillery, we have 17, so we need 8 more, we'll send 9, and then we actually need to get our cavalry, and uh, we'll get our infantry out whenever these guys make it in. It's 1.9%. So we could take most of, we'll just leave a couple infantry, uh, there's no good place for these guys to stand, I guess they can just stand back there. Well, where are these guys going? Are you going to try to engage somewhere? I mean, we have a nice... Nice defensive wall. Oh, Chinoa is getting screwed. Maybe we can have the Timurids play offensively, although their Liberty Desire is 51 now. Huh. Bulgaria is just going to be <sighs> wanting liberty until the end of time because of what happened. Alright, Austria, come on. Lose your enthusiasm. Hmm, when are they arriving? 17th? 19th? 15th? Maybe we can bait Austria in. I don't think they see that we're entering here. Um, 17th, 19th, nope. Shouldn't have moved that army in then. Oh, now they're getting jebated. They 50%, nice. This should be... Hopefully a win for us. They have the crossing penalty. We have reinforcements coming. That is one slaughtered Austrian stack. Hopefully that tanks their enthusiasm. We didn't lose too much for it. Scenario is not going to reinforce, is he? I guess we could send this mercenary up there with him. That could work. Is Russia over here now? No, Spain's actually all the way over there. I think the Timurids could handle Spain though. I'll actually tell them to play defensive. They have way more troops than that 44k stack. Later, man. Thanks for coming by, dog. Hope you have a good night, my friend. My new friend, at least I think. I don't know, maybe we're not friends. Yeah, man. It was nice meeting you. I'd love to see you again. Austria. Zero. So Austria will leave soon, which is perfect. 
think we just wait one more month and they will. Oh, that's Russia, not Austria. Yeah. Either one more month or taking one more province and they should leave. There it is. So that's 44, five years. Um, we could push for them to truce break Russia. That would probably require, well, that's an easy siege actually. That's an easy siege as well. So yeah, I think we will do that. Oh, thank you for the follow, man. Much appreciated. Definitely have a good night. Oh, if I see you again like tomorrow sometime, I'll give you an update on how things turn out. Yeah, I think we want them to truce break at least Russia. That's the only one we care about, right? I don't think we care about, well, maybe the Commonwealth too. Makes it a seven year peace. Think that that is achievable. Where is that Spanish army going? They're gonna try to come up here and pop our mercenaries, I imagine. I assume. So we're gonna get the mercenaries out of there. Uh, I think that was us losing a siege. How are the Timurids doing? You should be able to handle that. Come on, Timurids. You guys are beasts. You've got this. Uh, they're going to Salzburg. I think we're gonna go stand in the mountains. Got the Siege of Prague. Nice. We can actually get them out with these two, annoying those two treaties. If we take money, it's 47, 46, that's only a year. We don't need the money. We just want them out of here so that we can fight Spain. Yep. All right, yeah, that'll leave them with, when we peace out France, we can have France cancel the guarantee. And they'll just be out of people we don't care about. So let's take that. Uh, truce break, truce break. Wait a second. Russia and Commonwealth, right? Oh, and Russia, yep, okay. For a second there, I didn't see that. I was like, ooh, that's awkward. Um, so now we need to move all of our armies up into our own lands. And we need to get working on our war goal. Wonder if we'll have enough money. We probably won't have quite enough money Oh, that's a friggin' huge fort. That's a big fort. We're gonna have to siege this one, though. Since our war goal is Lucka. Alrighty, well, as long as we micro this well, should be able to win it. I just don't know where we want everybody to stand. It's really cramped in here. We don't have a lot of room and we have a lot of units. Uh, none of those guys are mercenaries. Uh, we lost our leader. So we'll make our leader a general again. He really sucks, but 
Better than having no general. Uh, we have the plus five. 